Hi everybody, Angela here to let you know my latest weight update this morning was 170.8 down from 179.4 in less than a week. It's day six, so that's fantastic news right there. Also, I wanted to do this vlog for the Hunger Fix journal. I'm reading this book called The Hunger Fix that talks about how you have to have a vlog. It's a really compelling thing. They say more than a snapshot video is a good piece of evidence to show how far you've come along. So. One thing I also want to mention is I saw a picture of myself sideways yesterday. It actually, I saw a video of myself yesterday and I was completely horrified and appalled with how big I looked from the side. My legs are not big, my arms are not big because I'm not, oh, I'm an apple shape, but my stomach was huge. It just looked really bad. So that's definitely motivation for me to lose weight. I also want to speak to my future self. This is according to uh, the notes I wrote down from the book. I need to speak to my future self to remind myself when you work so hard for something, try to maintain, try to stay there because I've lost weight before. I have a problem maintaining. I don't have a problem losing. So what's the point of all this yo-yoing? It's actually really bad for your health. So let's try to stay this time. So I'm supposed to remind my future self what false fixes have done and why I want to change them. Okay, a false fix is, the book says, something that gives you that dopamine rush in your brain gives you the happy hormones or gives you the happy signals in your brain but are really bad for you question one what has brought me to this moment crazy binge eating lack of planning lack of self-discipline i hate telling myself no um i also hate feeling hungry which is sad because hunger is like a natural body process to tell you when you should eat so I've been trying to work on that. I've been trying to feel the hunger and not get upset about it. It's not like I'm starving to death. Oh gosh, I am so not starving to death. So why am I trying to lose weight? I wanna fit my clothes again. Cosmetic reasons are always my number one reason. I hate to say it, I don't have any health problems. I do think that cosmetic reasons are a good reason to start, but health reasons and better quality of life are a reason to continue. So that's really what I'm trying to look at here. So I'm supposed to talk about what am I walking away from and what am I walking toward. I need to make better on the spot decisions. One uh, example was this Saturday when I went snorkeling with my friend and her fiance, they stopped at Dunkin' Donuts to get some breakfast. They brought me, without me asking for it, just a nice surprise, a Dunkin' Donuts latte, decaf, iced, delicious, and I should have just been like, thank you so much, you are so thoughtful, but I'm not supposed to eat or drink anything like that right now. Instead, to be polite, I swear it was just out of politeness, I really didn't even have a desire for it. It looked good, but I wasn't like, oh, I'm gonna die if I don't have that, no cravings. But I drank two or three sips out of politeness. It was only like that much out of a huge monster cup of it, but it was enough to make me not stall, but not lose as much as I had been losing. I think that that night I only lost 0.4 pounds and every other night I've been losing a pound or more. So I know that that was probably one reason that contributed to the not big loss like I saw. So anyway, that's my latest update, but overall I'm very pleased to be back down to 170. I can't wait to be back in the 160s, so I'm definitely trucking along. I've been doing a lot of physical activity, unintentional. Snorkeling I don't do for the health, I do it for the fun. Um, but that was two days in a row, so I was really pushing it out there. Also today at work I walked a lot. Oh, and yesterday I walked a lot at work, so yesterday was like swimming and walking. And when I walk, it's in the South Florida sun, so I'm dripping sweat, so a lot of exercise going on here. So that's my update. I hope you enjoyed and thanks for sticking with me on my journey. Have a great day. Bye.